hello you guys welcome back to my channel and I am going to do another makeup tutorial <laughs> and today is solely an experience <laughs> I'm going to try something new again today so I like to mix and match things until I can find what I really like and sometimes you just can't be afraid to go outside of your comfort zone so today I'm going to be working with the Cat Find D in the MAC makeup. Yeah, I'm going to mix them together like I did the NARS and um, the L'Oreal and see how it comes out. My daughter invited me out. She told me that she needed me to meet her when she got off work today and she needed to take me shopping. She says, well, I have to get you a sweatsuit because it's cold and you don't seem to dress warm enough. So I said, I don't want a sweatsuit. She said, you're getting a sweatsuit. <laughs> so we're going to the mall to look for a sweatsuit so I can dress warmer. I went to Walgreens and I picked up a couple of things. I picked up the Real Technique brushes. A case came in it and they called it the two-in-one case. These are the brushes that were inside. The detail brush, the pointed foundation brush, the buffer brush, the contour brush. Me and my daughter is sharing this. She took out what she wanted, and I always get the leftovers, which I don't mind. I'm going to make use of it. This is the little case it came in. I thought it was so cute. Now, I put some of my favorite brushes inside the case. But you can see, this is the brush that she left me. And this is the brush next to it that she left me also. The other ones, I just kind of stuck them in there. But I thought this was so fabulous. This is so cute. Look at that, you guys. This is so cute. today I also picked up the scandal eyes this was five dollars and 99 cents and it also came with an eyeliner the eyeliner is free so I was like wow I gotta get that plus I ran out of the Kaylin eyeliner yeah so we're gonna be using this today went to the beauty supply We're going to be doing eyelashes today. Now, I'm going to do them on camera. I don't do eyelashes. I don't mess with eyelashes. Actually, I'm scared of eyelashes. <laughs> I'm scared they're not going to go on right. I'm scared they're going to poke me in my eye. I'm scared they're not going to stick on. But I'm going to try them on for you guys today. <laughs> the eyelashes. So hopefully I don't make nobody crack up laughing because I really don't want nobody to laugh. But you know what? If it's funny, I'm going to laugh at myself. I don't need y'all to laugh at me. I can laugh at myself. I have no problem doing it. So I'm super flat. It's eyelash adhesive, but it's the rubber type. So I never tried this before, but I'm going to do it today on camera for you guys. So we got a couple of cheeks. Let's get started because I got to get out of here. Can't be here all day. I gotta get out of here and get on the road. So my daughter don't be like, where's she at? I'm right here. Pimps for the lips, of course. Velocity Miracle Worker, which is an anti-aging cream. Because we all know I'm 45. I have it listed in almost every video that I am 45. Not half a year before I'm 46, you guys. So I'm just going to enjoy 45. I enjoy being 44. I'm growing old, you guys, and I am happy that I get to grow old. Oh, hey. Skin smell feels really nice. I used the Philosophy Scrub last night. And I got the UV blender. They don't have a bite out of it today. Before we get started, I'm going to use this gleam. And today I'm going to put it directly on my face. 
Oops. I'm gonna put it in the areas that I would like to glow. So Cat 5B, Real Technique Brush. Okay, because I just want time to really go by fast. I'm kind of excited about going to the mall. I really don't want a sweatsuit. I'm thinking about, I don't buy clothes. And see if I can find me some cute blouses that I like. Or dresses, or skirts. I hate pants, you guys. I don't like to wear pants. I don't like jeans and pants. I like skirts, and I like dresses. But, so I'm only going to look for dresses, skirts, and some nice blouses, some nice sweaters, maybe. I'm not making no promises, you guys. So, yeah, you might see me with the same blouse on here and there, same sweater on here and there, because that's what's in my closet right now. When I started making the videos, I didn't think about that I would need to have a wardrobe. And my daughter said, Mom, what are you going to do when you start dating? You don't have no clothes. <laughs> and they're ready for me to be. <laughs> I enjoy spending the majority of my time with my children, friends and family. I didn't want to date because there's times that I don't feel good. Okay, I'm going to go with another drop. And that did pretty good. I liked it the way the mat went on, nice and smooth. And it was just nice and creamy. It didn't dry up as quick as it would do with the Mars. So I'm liking that. So, I didn't want to date when I found out that I had a bone disease. Yeah, guys, I have a bone disease. And I didn't want to date because the majority of the time, I'm, I'm usually suffering with some type of pain. And I, I don't know if I can really make anyone really happy, you know, with the fact that some days I'm not going to be feeling well and they might want to do something special and I make plans and I'd be so excited about it and then all of a sudden out of nowhere I can't move I can't walk it hurts to breathe so 
so. I am not scared today. I have no shy bone in my body. I'm my mother's spitfire. But when I found out that I had a bone disease, I just wanted to focus on what I can do to have a better quality of life. And dating was not at, at the top of the charts. But if it's meant for me to date, then I will date. But I'm not going to let my kids rush me into it. My daughter told me, she says, Mom, you get so much attention. People seem to love you and like you everywhere you go. She said, I see the men, they try to get your attention, and you don't even pay them no mind. She says, it's like you're rejecting the fact that someone may want to date you. Mm, you guys, I have to check myself and think about that. Maybe I am. Maybe I shouldn't not date just because I have a bone disease. Because I do have a lot to offer as far as personality. I think I'm a fun, smart, intelligent, funny person. Most of the time I'm really silly. <laughs> no, all the time. I'm silly. <laughs> this guy's crazy. But yes, this is really pretty. I think this came out really, really pretty. And that's two drops. One drop of the Cat Fondy on one side and one drop on the other. And the same thing with the MAC. This is a really great. This is what I like when you don't have to use a lot of foundation to get the job done. Okay, you guys. Now that we're done with that, we're going to use we're going to use some concealer, which is the LA Pro. This one is the Honey. We're going to go underneath the eyes. Now, this is my first time using this concealer. I have my blender. I wet it, okay, before I use it. I'm going to go up towards my, my bone area and highlight me because I love that part of my face. If you notice, you guys, my sponge don't have a bite in it today.
making sure I get inside the crease of the nose. I'm putting some color left on the sponge. I don't think I'm gonna just do my chin and my cupid's bow. I'm gonna use a lighter LA concealer, which is the almond. Almost like the same color to me. Go and use the eyebrows. Pretty right? Yeah. Okay, so now that I'm done with the concealer, I'm gonna go ahead and use my MAC Finish Powder. I'm gonna use the Real Technique brush. This is like a soft powder brush. And you do all around your face. The Mac Finish Foundation Powder. Sorry, guys, if you hear the puppy crying again. He's always crying. He's left every day by himself when he's sad. I don't even think they, they take him for a walk. I seen him one time. The puppy is actually brown. He's actually mine color. He's really pretty. And he called him Brownie. And he was so little. He's like this little. He's so tiny. When he see me, he barks like he's a big turtle. <laughs> he's so little. And he always crying every day. I'm going to use the contour palette, the LA Colors. I'm going to go ahead and contour my nose. I'm going to use this color today. The LA honey on my nose. I don't want to really date and then, you know, be all excited about it and then have to cancel the date because I'm not feeling good. But my daughter said, just if I meet someone that I really like, just explain to them. Be 100. But she said, you should limit yourself, mom. Because you're such a beautiful person, you should share 
who you are it's fine I said I'll think about it I'm gonna go ahead and use the concealer contour brush I'm going to use the darker color brown which is right there around three o'clock so a lot of children are getting home from school people coming home from work so you're going to hear some noise in the background i'm gonna try to block some of it out but i probably won't be able to do it all so forgive me if i can't do it all please okay i'm gonna use some blush now i never use this before about you guys so. trying blushes because on my color skin it doesn't seem to show up the way i want it to my blush brush Real good up there because I want it to show up. I'm actually smiling guys usually I, when I'm putting on my brush I go but I'm actually smiling because <laughs> I'm liking this pink it's so pretty mm, I'm all blushy Seems like a winner. So now that I've done that, I'm going to use the Missy Lynn palette and I'm going to use the highlight and I'm going to use the rose gold color. Okay, now that I have my highlight going on, I'm going to use the Smashbox Spray Photo Finish Primer Water to set my face. So good, so good. I'm liking it so far. The LA Contour Palette for my eyes, I'm going to use. This light color right here. And it almost looked like a bronze. Now it might be a bronze, but I'm gonna use it for my eyes. Just a little. I usually don't go dark and edgy, but I'm gonna do it today. And I'm gonna use this 
pretty like it's like a black and green color it's so pretty She's doing it. She's doing it. She's rocking it. She's. You guys are having such a wonderful day going into the evening. I'm gonna wipe off my brush. I'm gonna go in with the icon latte, which is this color right here. I'm just gonna kind of brown it in. So it don't look so harsh. Oof. My goodness. That's pretty. But you know, what I'm finding out with the icon, eyeshadow is loose. Gonna open it up. There's the eyeliner pencil that came in the package. Yes, I'm loving this. It goes on so smooth. Wow. Where have you been all my life? Oh yeah, this is definitely, this is worth the five ninety nine, dollars if not more. Oh, I would definitely buy this again. I, now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to smoke, rub it in, smoke it, give it like that smoke effect. Wow, wait till my daughter try this. She's going to love this. She's going to absolutely love it. The eyeliner is perfect. I'm going to go a little bit above my eyelash liner. See, and I usually don't do this, but because it's so small, I feel confident that I can put a little up there and not be afraid to, you know, that... I'm going to poke myself because it's so soft.
to use the Milky Way to see what's my favorite color right here. I want to use that to go in my eyebrow area. I'm just doing some more blending. Got a young teenage group out there coming home from school. Stay in a distance. Hopefully it don't bother you too much. And then what I'm going to do is that I'm just going to take a little of the same color and go underneath and I'm going to go up. I'm going to go in with the icon again and I'm going to use this. This color called Smoke. And I'm just going to use it in the creases of my eyes. I'm going to do the other eye. Now I'm just blending. So far, so good. Let's get the outline out of the way. I'm using the NYX eyebrow gel. Now you guys, I'm not good at this. I'm still practicing. And I'm actually practicing on camera with you guys. <laughs> Ever since I've been doing it, I've been doing it on camera with you guys. Hopefully I get better and better. It might go silent because it's too noisy, but I, I'm not going to just not show you what I'm doing. I want you to feel the full experience that I'm doing. <laughs> so, what I see is what you see. you guys so now that I got that done we're going to use the mascara scandal scandalous scandalous
right now. pretty that's pretty oh yes I love this make you want to bat your eyes <laughs> you guys thank you for hanging in there with me I'm so nervous we're about to start the eyelashes let me go ahead and open it Which I told my daughter that I actually put my eyelashes on camera for the first time by myself. I am speaking it into existence. I am going to do this and I am going to do this well. <laughs> Super flex. Okay, I'm looking at the directions. It looks easy. Okay. They say uh, just one, two, three steps. The eyelashes wait 20 to 30 seconds and number three, gently apply. To the eye Okay. I can feel my hand shaking. I ain't even gonna lie. Let me use the tweezers. I'm already feeling like this is not going to work out. Like I'm literally shaking. So now, you guys, I successfully put on eyelashes. I'm going to add some more flex here to put my eyelashes into the eyelashes. is underneath the dark green right underneath my waterline
thank you guys for watching. I hope you like the finished look. And I will see you again next time.